All right, so everyone should be seeing the uh, the Windows 8 desktop here on the VM. And then over here on the right, I've just got the website up. This DA Win 8 is this computer you're seeing on the left here. Um, right now, I'm just on the web computer page. So it's really as simple as just going down the destroy drive and clicking that and waiting a couple of minutes. So I'll go ahead and trigger that now. And we'll give it a second here and you'll see this computer start to turn itself off and then it won't be bootable after that. The other thing to note relative to this, so we do confirm that the command was received and that the destroy was conducted. Um, it's important to note that if you don't cancel the destroy request after you've initiated once and then you reinstall um, on that specific machine with that um, machine name and user, <coughs> we will we'll still believe that we need to issue that command because it comes up and says, hey, I'm, I'm the machine that, that existed. So you have to remember that if you're deploying that machine again, you either have to rename it or cancel the destroy request 